Eliza Kassan, Nightly World News. This place looks different, or maybe I just haven't been here in a little while. I haven't played since yesterday, technically. Keeping an eye on you. Wee wee hoo. Shut up. Just, just a hands up. I realized something, by the way. I can do this. Okay, my game just went whacker because of that. Like lagged a little. That was funny. Um. Okay. Cool. Except you do realize my height is a little higher than others, which means I just wasted a fucking buyer cell. Your crane's working now. Uh, all is down there. I need to get up there. Yep, come on. He says don't do the front door. So let's go up here. Oh, fudge. <laughs> Get up there! Okay. Too stupid to use. Um, that was close. Think maybe someone died wearing these uniforms. Maybe. We got this. Idiots everywhere. Okay, let's go up here. Nope. Oh, come on. We could do it. Guess not. Okay, let's jump on here. Whee! Oh, fuck. <laughs> Is that like not part of the world? Hmm. Oh. I wasn't paying attention. What are we doing now? That dark. What's this place? Don't blow your car. Refrigerator. Uh, computer? Can I hack it? Yes. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Cool. Um, Lena, I spoke with the bank and they're expecting her. I already signed you up. I'm signed, so you can just remove all the money and close the account. Try not to worry, I share your concerns. But what choice do we have? Without a perma, we're going we're going nowhere, and we're not getting one from the government. They've made that clear enough. When we were young, we used to go to concerts and pay the scalpers twice, sometimes three times the original ticket price. This is the same thing. When we get to Rabi, I'm Rabia, we can worry about the next steps and use this um use the other half of the money. That young girl um, that young girl may have made us feel like beggars when she was explaining the cost, but a loan from Santior might be the only way. I know it was heartbreaking for you to part with some of the things we had to sell, but we still have our work, and the promise of a better life to look forward to. This will be worth it, I promise you. I'll see you in the morning later. I'll, I'll see you at home later this evening. Take care. Peter. Or Peter, however you want to pronounce it. Um, well, okay, that was more mail, though. Helena and Petter, I wanted to let you know personally that the money has been transferred to your account and express my appreciation another time for the wonderful work of art you have brought into this world. I cannot wait to see how it looks on the walls of my new home in Rabia. I may not be, um, it may not be my place to tell you what to do with the money you have just received, but if you have time for me the opinion of Patreon, I would like to recommend that you consider going to Rabia yourself. I've watched Santiago's CEO Nathaniel Brown more than once on television. Speaking of how the city will provide a haven for augmented people to be able to express themselves without fear of public opinion. Artists such as yourself would thrive there, I'm sure. The cost is significant, but certainly worth it to be out of Prague. Um, Prague. Or Prague. Imagine walking the streets a warm sun o um, upon every augmented head, surrounded by our kind and never having to worry about bigots or violence. If Brown is right, then I can only imagine opportunities galore for you both. Every now, every new city attempting to make its mark in the, in the world must encourage great art, especially one as remarkable as Rabia. Whatever your decision, I wish you both the very best and hope someday to see you again. Good luck in your endeavors and farewell. Yours sincerely, Jacob Zambon. Interesting. Uh, anything else? What's this? It's like a box. Okay. 
Oh. Interesting. Okay, I don't need to read that. Uh, turn that off so it doesn't waste my energy. International galleries have, se have seen an increased demand for ma m marginal artists, including works created by the augmented. This may seem controversial to some, but the art world has never shielded, um, has never sh shied from that. In fact, augmented artists may have found a powerful ally in the form of Nathaniel Brown, CEO of the Santia Group, a professed art connoisseur. connoisseur. Brown has also has already undertaken to open an impressive art gallery in Rabia. He also plans to offer grants specifically to augmented artists to come live and work in the deserts, in the desert oasis. I think the augmented, due to their particular nature and the nature of their enhancements, create art differently. I say, um, says Brown. They may well influence a whole new movement, and I encourage other patrons of the art in Rabia and elsewhere to embrace these arts. The fact remains that for now, augmented artists remain in the fridge, in the fringe, and that getting to Rabia to enjoy what seems to be inviolable art artistic freedom may be well beyond most. Most influence, a whole new movement, and I encourage other Patreons of the arts in Rabia and elsewhere to embrace these artists. Wait. What the fuck? It's basically the same thing, but you're able to scroll down. <laughs> okay, I was like, oh, there's a continuing bit. Wait, no, there isn't. It's just the same fucking thing. Don't blow your cup. Good. Wee. Wee. Okay. Um. Yeah. Pocket secretary. Lady be calm, I'll be home soon. Hide what we agree behind the wall and let me do the talking when they arrive tonight. There's thugs, but surely any money is better than none. We'll have our permits soon. Peter, this is the message he sent below. They're not giving up. We can't afford to spend any everything we have. This was a stupid idea. Peter, what are we going to do? These men are dangerous. I can't believe we're living like this. Um, forward. A deal is a deal. A permit. Um, permits don't come cheap for a reason. So the price is what it is. The government isn't going to look well on me helping people like you get out of the prague. So I make sure it's worth something our time to give you a happy ending. Um, we'll um we'll be there as agreed. He did an error there. So make sure you have <laughs> you have the money, all of it. Pleasure doing business with you. Ooh, credits, nice. This was definitely worth my time. Was it worth you guys? 2,870 now. Cool. Hmm. Say something. Interesting. Is that where Collar is? Hang on. No, it isn't. Where's Collar then? Oh, he's way over there. Wait, no. What the fuck? Okay, maybe I toggled it off accidentally, because that can happen. Um, yeah, here it is. Okay. That's odd. Only if I'm zoomed in does everything show. Um, where the fuck is Cola? I was caught off guard. Okay, but I'm trying to find fucking Cola. Cola. I don't even fucking care. Okay. Oh, it is. It says call here. Call of the time machine. Okay. So, if I'm able to take these guys out... Fucking 
got the building over there. If I can just take these guys out, I will be 100% fine. Um, can I, like, get over there without being detected? That's what I'm wondering. Please, seems to be a place over there. Will I die from that? Oh, good, I'd be Chris. I was a little worried. Come here. I think I saw something. Yeah, you... I forgot this place was detected! Fucking hell! <laughs> Oh shit! Okay. Us included. At least it will fill in all the potholes. True. This one tried to swallow a car. Reminds me of when I was a kid. I can't imagine. Oh, that was close. Hey. Oh shit. Hey. Not like this. Not like this. Yeah, not like this. Please attack them. <laughs> Attack them, robot! Attack them! Hey! This is our territory. He won't last long. <laughs> Oh shit! Robots! Are on my side. Hey, cops. Wasn't I just here? Oh, right, I was going over there. Is he dead? You're fucking kidding me. These cops were useless. Well, I guess they got rid of some. Are they gonna come closer? Because I can't do shit while I'm here. Okay. Thank you. Really like it when you come closer. Oh, I'm waiting. I'll just reload. So doing a lethal playthrough. <laughs> I'm not sure if I said I was going to do a non-lethal or lethal, but it's turning into a lethal one. Whew. Welp. Anyone else?
I don't know. This guy was using a pistol. Where's your pistol? Someone here? Oh. Okay. Where the fuck is your pistol, man? What if he isn't even here? How much more time do we have to waste here? This place is fucking mess. Hmm, maybe I have to... I'm gonna go sneak into a window. Even though I could go through the front door just as easily. I want to just surprise these guys. Say hello. Yobok is back. Bring me his Hi. You're kidding me. Am I out of bullets? I'm out of bullets, of course. Where did this guy go? <laughs> he was hiding behind here the whole time. Oh well. Looking my friends are on their way, eh? Oh shit. Hi. Can I say hello to your friends? Oh, I guess it's too late, sorry. Painkillers! Why are you having painkillers? I feel sorry for you now. I killed a guy with a medical injury. Eh, too late. Jensen, thank God. I'm down in the dungeon, man. You remember the title of my super secret book, right? I remember it's red. Oh, <laughs> that was already obvious before he said it. I'm like, turned around before he said red. I'm like, oh, it's a red book. <laughs> Workshop, eh? Oh, three pra I can't use the Praxis kits, okay? Why did I get three right off the bat, or is that part of the I'm um, the first day edition? Oh, cutscene. Jensen, my favorite techno wonder kind. Sorry about the goons, man. They, uh, they didn't give you too much trouble, did they? They're not going to be a problem anymore. What do they want? You behind on your protection money? I... I don't think it's about money. I got this little misunderstanding with their boss, Otar. You know how it is with these gangster types. Enough to know that there's no such thing as a little misunderstanding. The Valley internal politics. I... I'm gonna get it sorted. Gonna see the big boss myself. As soon as things settle down. The day after a bombing, man, it's... Well, I mean, it's scary, right? I'm surprised people go out at all. Sometimes people don't have a choice. My systems took a hit. I was hoping you could help me get everything running again. Took a hit? You mean... Oh, shit! Why didn't you say so? We need to get you in the chair. The chair. You know I've always wanted to get a closer look at those saddy fogs of yours. A real close look. <laughs> so, uh... So let's strap you in, get the gas going, and then... Well, then I just need to sort of dive in. Well, feel my way around. This is the augmented, per um, was it, version of Perfect's. Um, what are you going to do to me? What exactly are you going to do to me? I'm not sure yet. First, I got to get in there to see what's wrong. But don't worry. I'm not going to do anything to you I wouldn't do to myself. <laughs> I promise. Besides, you've been here a few times. You know I'm professional. You've never had to put me under before. I never saw you the day after an explosion before either. That was a big shock to your system, man. Kaboom! Now, you want me to fix you or not? Yeah, but I've been through a lot of explosions in Days X and Revolution. I didn't need anything. I've been hit by a few frag grenades, and yeah, I died. Frag grenades, I mean, not frag grenades. But I've taken about two of them at once, sometimes, and I didn't 
kept my Hulkman's ruins, sir. Hey, That's just sec, bullshit. Put me under for how long? What if the Diwali send reinforcements? And those are direct. Aww, oh, you're just stalling. Those illiterates aren't going to get in here. Don't be scared of the chair, okay? <laughs> the chair is gentle. I promise. Are you gentle? This thing with the Diwali is nothing. Otar's pissing where he shouldn't. I count on you to fix me, Kohler. To some extent, your problems are my problems. That's sweet, Jensen. Otar Botkoveli is the Diwali number two guy. The men outside, they were his men. But the big boss man is Radic Nikolatze. He is the number one guy. And I know Radic, so... So don't worry about it. I'm worrying. Now, are we gonna do this procedure, or what? Oh, uh, fine. Alright, let's just get this over with. Relax, Jensen. Um... I can't hear sound. What the fuck just happened? You guys see sound? I What happened? Um give me a second please. Okay, we're back. Hopefully the sound doesn't cut out this time. Alright. Let's just get this over with. Relax, Jensen. Oh fucking hell, you're kidding me. It's gonna be fine, you you won't even know I'm in there, you'll feel weightless far away like you're somewhere else, but Cole is gonna bring you back and make you you again before you know it. Do I have to fucking read this seriously? Because my mic like no not the mic. The voice is annoying. Um I'm sorry. What the fuck? Should I restart the shit, Jensen? Wake up, man. Wake up. Oh, not again. Shit, shit, shit. Come on. Sound. Uh, what? Oh, thank God. Take it easy. I swear I didn't mean to. Your retinal display should be back soon. You can still move, right? Thank God. Take it easy. I Wait, okay. What did you. I was, I was trying to connect the unconnected, but you got some strange fucking orgs back there. Okay. I'm going to try restarting my game because I can't read all this. You don't even know I'm in there. You feel weightless. Far away, like you're someone else. But Kohler's gonna bring you back and make you you again. Before you know it. Okay, so I restarted my game and it's all good now. Sorry. Here it is. What? Oh my god. Take it easy. I swear I didn't mean to. Your retinal display should be back soon. You didn't still do, huh? Where, where did you? I was. I was trying to connect the unconnected. But you got some strange fucking ogs back there. I mean, I, I probably shouldn't have. Uh, here, let me get you some water. Or something stronger, maybe? Water. You got it, Jensen. Just, uh. Just ease out. Okay? Don't freak out. Rebooting was the only way to save you. Save me from what, Carl? Core meltdown. You almost melted my chair. So I reset you, and I found these... These, uh... I think it's better if I show you what I found. Bring up your system display. You need to see this for yourself. Are you telling me I lost my these fucking Icarus landing? You're familiar with all these, right? Yeah. David Seraph installed them. Took two years for my body to get used to everything. Right. Well... I had to undo some of that getting used to. What's going on, Kohler? Why do I feel different? Something was trying to vampire the juice out of you. I couldn't figure out what until after the reboot. Turns out your Factory Zero is not the standard Factory Zero. What, what am I looking at? What the fuck? Mental fucking test dogs, man. Hidden inside your body. You're telling oh. me I got more implants than I thought I did? More than your body can handle. Pretty cool, right? I'm not sure yet. I want to show you what happens when you activate one of these suckers. Uh, click the icon to select one of the... one of the... okay. Uh, which one? 
I'm going to go this. This one seems cool. The targeted electrical discharge, um, discharge system, also known as the Tesla, uh, is capable of firing a 200 milliamp uh, arc of electricity used for incapacitating targets. The high current causes muscular contractions strong enough to clamp down on the heart okay, and prevent Jensen. full cardiac One isn't gonna kill um, arrest. You've said that before. <laughs> Leaving the target unconscious but alive, it can be used on real people and machines, probably. Tesla is powered by experimental aluminum graphite now the batteries housed within the forearm. Holy shit, okay. See that? Major spike in your power consumption. Where the System hell did status unstable. Come from? I can't answer that. All I know is the explosion must have woken them up. But man, you wanna use these crazy fucking things? That's your right. We just gotta make sure it doesn't fry you. Now I think I maybe got an idea on how to do that. Try shutting down one of your other implants. You know, just for fun. Uh, press change deactivation status to see which augmentations can be disabled. Once selected, press disable. Go ahead, Jensen. Shut down one of the implants you're not using. Um, what's this one? The information warfare, social enhancer, glass shield cloaking. No, I need that. Icarus landing, I definitely need that. Um, Quicksilver Reflex ahead, Booster. Jensen. Shut up! Shut down one of the implants you're not uh, using. The Quicksilver Reflex Booster is essentially a supercharge for the human nervous system. The booster works by activating the attention, um, but in the parasympathetic nervous system while activating the Fagus nerve. Go ahead, Jensen. Fucking shut, shut up! Shut down one of the implants you're not using. It enables military personnel, athletes, and physical performance to execute quicker, more impressive feats of strength. Yeah, shut up. See that? Cooled you right down. Oh, okay. That's you cool. You have the power to balance your system if you want. Just, you know, don't activate everything all at once. What would happen if I did? Well, you'd suffer some major glitches due to overheating. We're talking risk of permanent damage. So, you know, maybe don't do that. All right. Reset me now, Kohler. I'll reactivate what I need myself. Interesting. Okay, so I'm not always going to be there for you like this. I can't just follow you around to reset things and hold your neural weave together. Whatever choices you make from here on out, they're your choices. I thought you were supposed to be my AUG expert. I specialize in Chinese black market, okay? The shit I found hidden inside you, spliced into your system like that, looks to me like it's from Mars, man. I'm pretty sure they're not from Mars. <laughs> I just... I feel bad. You deserve answers. you can't answers. tell me where that came I... from. As far as I know, David Seraph installed all my ox. There's something inside me I don't know about. He's the one I need to talk to. I am familiar with Saris work. These new ox, they... They look different to me. I mean, that neodymium shell. Who uses dimorphic magnetoreological fluid like that? Seriously, if you talk to Sarit, you need to ask him that. Shit really stands out. Pretty fucking cool, actually. <laughs> it is, I must admit that. He's all like, I don't want these orgs. And I'm like, you can fucking shut down people's hearts with cardiac arrest. <laughs> you ever seen someone like this before in orgs? And it's deliberately hidden like that. Um, what would Seraph have hidden these things inside me? I don't get it. You ever seen anything like this before? An AUG system that's deliberately hidden like that? I don't know, Jensen. I mean, I heard of people getting the black market treatment before. Pass out in Prague, wake up in Shanghai. But usually they wake up with less AUGs, not more. What exactly makes these AUGs so different from my other ones? They look like experiments, is what? Loose wiring everywhere, man. It's, it's like half of you is uh, untested, unfinished, unbelievable. It's it's beautiful, is what it is. Hmm. Why would Seraph have hidden these things inside me? I don't get it. I am not convinced this is a Seraph job. Yeah, neither the am tech I. itself is super high end, but the P dot insulation sloppy. The bone mounting mounted on the quick just doesn't have satisfaction. 
Looks more like a retrofit to me. Something much more recent. Well, um, what are you thinking? I'm thinking how much I hate being unconscious. You said these additions look recent. How recent? Within the last two years, give or take. Something happened to you in that time? I was pulled out of the ocean and put in some facility in Alaska to recover. It was a few months there that... The more I try to remember, the blurrier it gets. Shit, Jensen. That's terrifying. This tune-up went longer than I expected. Let's wrap this up. Right. Here, take some Praxis kits for the trouble. Woohoo! Praxis solves everything. Yes, it Keeps does. customers happy. <laughs> Just uh, remember what I showed you about managing your juice. It's gonna be a balancing act for you. Thank you. Well, unless... Unless what, Kohler? There could be a way to optimize. It's just... It would involve getting something from Otar. A neuroplasticity calibrator. Oh? If there's a way for me to use everything I have without compromise, I want to know about it. Yeah! If there's a way for me to use everything I have without compromise, I want to know about it. I was hoping you'd say that. I order all my fancy tech from this illegal catalog, right? But Illegal. My Sorry. last shipment got intercepted by Otar Botkoveli. The same Otar whose men were looking for books out there before? I am not going to force you. I want you to want to do it. I want you to want to be an augmented god among men. <laughs> if that sounds like something that interests you, then you should know that Otar runs an underground casino in the Chisti district. The entrance is in a small courtyard off Hlavni Street. Thanks for the info, Connor. Thanks for the Praxis. How many Praxis have I got now? Five. Oh, yes. Fucking twelve! Ah! <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> Where did I get twelve from? Like, this is just the start of the game! Okay. Let's read everything. Social enhancer, we know what that is. We can talk to people and convince them and things unless they're heavily augmented. Hacking, yeah, we can upgrade more hacking. I need that priority because since I like stealthing around, but I was like killing people if it comes to it. That's the thing. I will be doing a mix of non-lethal and lethal, but if it comes down to shooting people, I will not hesitate. But I like hacking things. Um, what's this? Hacking fortify, so that increases the fortifying, uh, the time that goes up. Hacking stealth, less detection time. Infolink. The Infolink telecommunications package enables... Oh, that's already full. It's just communications, automatic. Stealth avatar. The stealth avatar upgrade activates upon detection, so that basically tells you where they last saw you. Lidar marker tracker. Marker tra mark tracker. You can basically track people. Smart vision. So he's basically taking my Icarus landing and everything away. Great. Um... This basically allows... Ooh, what is it? Um, smart vision. Yeah, I need that I need that as well. Retinal pros um, prosthetis. The I know retinal prosthetis. Prosthetis. Um, prosthetis. Whatever. Prosthetis. Is the basic limited range augmentation and must be implanted both eyes before further. More specialized devices can be purchased. The HUD projected by the prosthetis provides data on the user's medical condition. Available equipment, wireless access to personal... I was trying to do this. Oh, come on. Ah! Oh, fucking hell. Okay, fine, I'll do this then. An op optical membrane implant and data frame. is capable of projecting digital information directly on the retina. So it basically tells me about the person. Uh, wayfind, wayfinder radar map. Got it. Uh, that's just cells. RX health system is a massive and elegant augmentation made up of numerous units distributed throughout the body. Primary components are a series of hair fine sensors, probes connected to vital organs. They provide biomedical data to a central health motor. The unit tracks the medical condition of the user and triggers secondary modules when it registers critical damage through internal or external trauma. These modules are implanted into heart tissue. 
Um, you could explain to me what you do in a simpler way. Oh. Regenerate health and wounds. The default health value is set to 100 points. What is it on now? Uh, the default delay time between injury and the start of healing subsystem. So it's basically healing in three different ways. Um, that's cells. This is breathing and gases, but it's temporary. That's the bad thing. Print damage. Um, energy consumption. Like, holy shit. That's true, Praxis. I may need that as well. Um, punch through walls. Take down. Uh, carry capacity. Oh, okay. That's my inventory. Nice. Um, cybernetic weapon handling. Basic aiming movement control. Lightly reduced reticle. Substantially negates all movement induced reticle. Oh, that's cool. Um, that costs one Praxis kit each. Cool. I might actually get that sometime. The base recoil, recoil compensation provided by the cybernetic arm prosthetus. And the standard reload speed delivery provided by the cybernetic. Yeah, it's pretty good. It's only quickened by about two percent. I'm two hundred percent, so it's not that much, but it's good. Um, prevent damage when falling. Yeah, I'll definitely need this. How much is it? Two praxis. Cool. Um, perform more coordinated feats of strength and adversity. Perform takedowns on two adjacent adversaries. Yeah, that would be cool as well. But probably later on in the game. That's the thing. Um, turn invisible. Yeah, they'll definitely be in it, but how much? Two. I don't know why I'm clicking on it, it's down there. Protection for physical damage, won't need that just yet. Uh, experimental. Ne oh, it's okay, okay. Negate incoming damage for a short period of time. Cybernetic leg granting improved stamina. Okay, so this game has stamina. Let's check out the experimental. Um, fire concussive... Con Concussive blast and knocks down targets and scatters objects. Um, hack electronic devices from a distance. Ooh, that's nice. Um, in incavitates targets, human or electronic, with an arc of quiet high voltage electricity at a range of around a dozen meters. So basically, this require it requires praxis, but I have to shut down something else. Okay. Fire the nano blade as a projectile. <laughs> Holy shit, that's cool. But wouldn't that kill them? Yeah, it would. Um, accelerate core augmentations to improve reaction time. Oh, so it basically slows down time. Dash forward and enhance speed. Ooh. Those are awesome. I won't touch the experimental ones just yet, I think. Maybe this one, if I'm desperate. Okay, so the main ones I'll need is Icarus. S uh, Smart Vision. Now, what are the extras? Highlight useful items when the confines of the smart vision area are of, uh, of effect. Okay, it's enemies, robots, and devices. Okay, that's all I really need for now. Slightly reduce smart vision, okay. Of the energy, I mean. Um, invisibility. Where's invisibility? There's invisibility. Cool. Social enhancer, that was really important in the last game. Like, I'm not kidding. Um, I won't really need the tracking thing. I can use smart vision for that. Um, I'll get this because a lot of secret areas are hidden. And the rest can go on hacking for now. Uh, hacking level 2. And hacking level 3. Cool. I'm a little annoyed that I can't do anything else, but uh, it's just... How life is... What do you have? China's gang problem still holds second place to the criminal activity reigning, um, raging in the slave um, regions. Worse, the lines defining the Russian underworld have blurred since the formation of the Federated States in 2016, with many of the desperate neighbours swelling the Russia mafia to levels never, un um, never seen before. But for the latest and largest wave in the criminal underworld, you need to head further west of the restless... Um, Czech um, Republic <gasps> to run into the gang in our top spot for the re deserved reputation of the world's most wanted, the Diwali family. In 2000, is this basically going to be like. Oh, okay. 
In 2003, um, Levin Diwali, son of founding father and brutal crime lord um, Lakob, left his hometown. Yeah, it's basically the continuation of Batumi, Georgia, and um, Batami, Georgia, and set up a criminal shop in Prague. The Diwali have been in violent control of the European underworld ever since. With the rule of blood, their members can only be of direct Georgia descent. Levin Diwali has continued his father's brutal legacy by expanding, expanding their ruthless criminal family and redefining what it means to be a gang in the 21st century. Impressive. What do you have? I've been experiencing some strange symptoms since my last visit with you. This is unacceptable. You will do something about this, yes? I'll be expecting you tonight. Ask for Muroslava. She will bring you to me. I know, I know. I didn't know what else to do with the machinery. Poor fuckers were killed by the cops. And I didn't want this stuff to end up in some evidence locker or whatever. This is what they would have wanted, MV. At least this way it goes to help our people. Um, in some way. Mr. Collar, recently you ordered some equipment through us. Very special medical equipment from China. Normally I do not ask our clients why they want the things they ask us to get them. I simply negotiate terms and move on the terms. You negoti the terms you negotiate, however, were not done through me, and for that reason they remain unclear. I do not like business that isn't clear, so before I hand over your merchandise, you and I will need to talk. Come to the casino, or I will send my men to escort you there. Intriguing. Okay, there's a robotic arm there. Um, breach software. Nice. The collaborator, okay. Ooh, free, free, free multi-tool. Fucking love you, caller. Um, take. I'll use the painkillers. Use the wine. Use nose ray. Ooh, yes. Oh fuck yes. Eh, caller. Cola, 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 cola. <laughs> Jensen, are you, are you like, are you drunk again? Yes. Yes, I am. Oh, cola. I love you. Get out of my shop, Jensen. Fine. Fine. Oh, fucking hell. No, I pressed quick line. I'm lucky I quick saved that. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's do. Okay, I'm just. <laughs> I'm just gonna discard these. I'm not gonna use them. <laughs> what I was going to do was try to kill Collar and see if it works. No, I. Oh. Boom. And now, quick save. I can't use weapons here. Never mind. Oh, come on. Let me through. Thank you. And we're off. Oh. Wait. What? Well, isn't this place fucking fancy, Carla? Can I just go through here? Yeah, I can. Oh, <laughs> this place is fucking fancy. Well, good damn.